Welcome to Cyrene. Cyrenaica stretches across the coast of northwest Africa. It was known as Pentapolis in antiquity, a reference to the five main cities that formed the Greek colonies. Built on a lush plateau of the Green Mountains, in what is present-day Libya, a colony of Greek settlers formed the city of Cyrene in 630 BCE. Cyrene's population quickly grew, spreading out across the terraces of the plateau, making it the first and largest of the five colonies. The city of Cyrene was founded by Batos Aristotle, guided by the Oracle of Delphi. Overcrowded and suffering from drought, Batos's home island of Thera could not sustain its citizens. Batos consulted the Oracle, who told them to journey to the North African coast in search of arable land. A series of kings reigned over the city in the first two centuries. However, rebellion eventually ended the monarchy, and henceforth, the city was governed by the aristocracy. The key features of Cyrene were temples dedicated to gods, Apollo, Demeter, and Zeus, alongside Ptolemaic gods, such as Iset and Serapis. A large agora defined the city's center, and on the western edge, the famed Acropolis was built. A fortification wall was added around the harbor at the end of the second century CE. As the city grew, more buildings were constructed beyond the walls. Under Roman influence, Cyrene became an economic powerhouse, rising in status throughout the Mediterranean. Cyrene's school of medicine rivaled all others except for that of the Greek city, Kos. Some of the great minds in ancient math, astronomy, and geography were born or established in the various schools of the city, which included an institute of philosophy founded by Aristippus, a pupil of Socrates. From 115 to 117 CE, there was a revolt in the Jewish quarter that greatly damaged the city of Cyrene. Over time, a succession of battles, poor management of its silphium crop, and earthquakes eventually took their toll on the city. It was completely abandoned in 365 CE. The nearby port of Apollonia was an ideal location with its natural cove, sheltered by two islands and rocky inlets. Along with a lighthouse, the port was later equipped with keys and warehouses to accommodate the increased shipping traffic.
With its success as a commercial trading port, Apollonia surpassed Cyrene to eventually become the capital of the Pentapolis. A number of earthquakes gradually shifted the city, causing many of its original structures to sink. Some of its ruins can still be seen underwater. 